What's up everyone? I want to share something that happened this morning. My tablet reappeared. Now, you all know very well, oh too well I'm sure, that items consistently disappear with us. It, the disappearing item phenomenon is something that many of us deal with way too much. And so I, I was frustrated about the fact that my tablet had vanished. We went we went out on, uh, let's see, Saturday? Yeah, on Saturday, and the tablet, I brought the tablet, and I brought it in the suitcase. In the suitcase now, in the, the suitcase. I zipped it up in there, and I was thinking like, man, this, is, this suitcase is overfilled with things, but I left it in there, I never took it out. I left it in, the suit, in one of the suitcases, I had both of them. So, it reappeared. But here's what happened leading up to that point. It disappeared Saturday evening. It wasn't there when we got back home, and it wasn't there Sunday, and suddenly on Monday morning, I go back out there and say, this is really getting old. I moved everything in the vehicle, looked under the covers we had in there and everything. I looked everywhere. Everywhere. It wasn't in there. It should have been in the suitcase that I brought in the house because that suitcase is where it was at. That's what it was in, the suitcase. Well, I go to the mailbox. Basically, I'm about to go to the mailbox and check the mail. And I said, return my tablet. I'm getting sick and tired of this. I wish the same thing would happen with my crystals because I've asked the same, I've asked those as well because they're just, they're precious to me. I. I, I bought those crystals. I bought some crystal necklaces. I bought some amethyst quartz crystals. There were some pen, There were a bunch of pendulums. There were some. Uh, there were uh, pilot, uh, pilot, uh, pilotite. There is malachite. There, there is uh, some uh, rose quartz that I found. I actually found them, and uh, well, I'll share about that. Another. It was had to do with love and everything, and. Uh, this, this girl that I, uh, there was a girl that I really cared a lot about and then all of a sudden she was gone from this, the, she worked at the Dollar General, Dollar General and I cared a lot about her and it was prophesied by this, by this woman, this healing woman. She told us that I do know this person, that we're going to be together and this, that the Lord gave her this information and that we were going to be together and suddenly that woman's, that girl's gone and I don't know if that were true prophecy, you'd think that the girl wouldn't have been gone, but maybe we'll see each other again someday. But anyway, I always kept that love, that love quartz on me just in case whenever I went in there and she would, she called me honey. Have a good night, honey. She had a voice like this right here. It was really sweet. I love that girl. I still do to this day over all of, I mean, all, any, I, I don't even, I don't know. That. <laughs> see, that, see, that's exactly what it makes me do. It gives me like a, uh, whenever I think about, I, I literally just did that. Uh, uh, that right there, like that breathing in really quickly is exactly what I do when I think about her. And there was a person that claimed to do angel cards. But the long story short, when I walk back from that... Man, I switch a lot. I walk back from the mailbox after I demanded the tablet to be returned. Boom. That tablet was back. Mama said, no way. And I said, yeah. We both looked for it everywhere multiple times and it was leaning upward just like like oh it never got lost it never disappeared but physical objects disappearing reappearing that's something that you all know probably too well I've got another story as well to share very very soon regarding an experience of uh, that I had tonight a spirit experience it felt like someone touched my hip and then all of a sudden I felt compelled to go look at this toy that Granny got me when I was a child and so and it and I suddenly smelled her cigarette smoke so my Granny spirit it felt like it was around but I'll talk about that another time but that girl someone spoke to me and And she t uh, she told me someone spoke to me through what used to be the topics back the topics forums, but they don't they they don't have the topics anymore. It switched over to next door north and next door next door whatever nextdoor.com and a community forum. 
and this person said they did angel cards and they tried to communicate with people and we're going to try to help people out so I gave her some random numbers and she said the Lord was going to give her this information Archangel Michael and she was going to get information and share it with me and she asked does peaches mean anything to you and I, I was like does peach mean anything to you as to any of you and I said it means a lot to me I said you have no idea because it was a special thing that I first I'd really try to talk to her when that uh, girl whenever I I was in the uh, Dollar General aisle and I would go she was like peaches I was like oh she said oh peaches. like I said uh, she said no we, we don't have those or it was like she was so nervous and shy and I was too and I walked by I got spaghetti I was like spaghettios and I and I grabbed the spaghetti <laughs> I grabbed the spaghettios, and it was it was really funny. I mean, for me, it was personal. I liked that girl a lot. I, I cared a lot about her and felt like I loved her, but maybe I'll see her again. I don't know. But back to that story, the tablet reappeared, and that girl meant a lot to me that I haven't seen her in like two years now. I'm hoping maybe, maybe I'll find her again. I don't know. I don't have any idea. But it was not like, it wasn't lust, it was love. It was a totally different scenario, totally different thing. And um, we both seemed to have this mutual connection and care for each other. And she would always try to let me know that she would, she's like, just to let you know, I would do that too. Like, she would always try to tell me she'd do the right thing. And she was always trying to impress me and be really, you know, not in an overboard way, just a really sweet way. But I'll talk about that some other time. I just want to state that the tablet reappeared. I had a lot to share that I felt like sharing all of a sudden. Thanks to uh, the person that shared earlier with me. I appreciate that. There's several people I haven't heard from in a while. I hope you're doing well too. So just wanted to share some personal story time. The tablet reappeared. Peace and much love. Signing out. My links are below. The smallest donation can help out. And... Uh, and show that shows your support. I, I can't thank you all enough for sharing with me. Sixty people watching my videos. Really, technically, that's that's also just a that's a blessing as well in and of itself. It's like wow, it's like sixty people listen to my podcast, my vlog. <laughs> oh man, that was one of my last videos. I got sixty views. And I was like, man, that many people were listening to my voice, and that's just really really cool. I love you all so much, signing out, and I hope to speak with all of you again very soon. Thank you all to, for your lovely, lovely, kind comments. Signing out.